Hello, everyone. Welcome back to our channel and another daily devotion, the word for you today. I am Sister Maria Dwyer here at Community Baptist Church in Santa Rosa, California, sunny California. And we have today, be kind to others. Our scripture is Colossians 3 and 12, clothe yourselves with kindness. So here we go. We'll get right to it. When you get up in the morning, you must not only clothe yourself physically, but spiritually and emotionally too. You must ask yourself, what sort of attitude am I going to wear today? Will I be controlling or cooperative, <laughs> positive or negative, complimentary or critical, selfish or serving? You say, but when I'm kind, people take advantage of me. Yes, sometimes that will happen, but that's the difference between taking the low road or the high road. Amen. Which do you want to walk on? Despite the risks, here are two reasons to be kind. Number one, because of God's kindness, you have been saved. Ephesians 2 and 8. Grace and kindness go together, always. Poet Robert Burns said that the kind heart most resembles God. Remember that. Number two, because you want people to be kind to you and treat you right, Jesus said, do to others what you would have them do to you, Matthew 7 and 12. If you are rude, people are going to be rude to you. But if you are kind, most people will desire to respond the same way. Most people <laughs> be kind and honest and you will live a long life. Others will respect you and treat you fairly, Proverbs 21 and 21. And here's another reason to be kind. Your own soul is nourished when you are kind. It is destroyed when you are cruel, Proverbs eleven seventeen. So when you are kind to others, you are really doing yourself a favor. Let's read it again. As God's chosen people, holy and dearly loved, clothe yourselves with compassion, kindness, humility, gentleness, and patience. And that's Colossians 3 and 12. Now go out and try living that way for one whole day. <laughs> Give it a shot. Yeah. So, I mean, ask yourself, how would you have felt if someone said or did to you what you just did to them and it upset them? Like if you were rude or if they were rude to you, think to yourself, was I rude first? You know, sometimes we want to give ourselves the benefit of the doubt, but you know, once in a while we say and do things that offend people, whether we mean to or not, and that will come back to you, to anyone, you know, I mean, myself included. So it's kind of a, a check, you know, God's giving you a little, little nudge there. So go out and be kind, try it for a whole day and uh, be blessed, you know, give it a shot, see what happens. Uh, thank you for being here. If you haven't already done so, I don't think I mentioned it please make sure you click on that subscribe button. God bless you. We thank you and love you and, and appreciate all of your support. And we will see you tomorrow.